Hi, I'm Deborah from South Essex Slings. Uh, we're going to talk about bottle feeding in a carrier today. So I'm using a buckle carrier with crossed straps. Uh, if your baby is bigger, older, has good strong head neck control, a bit of torso control, so maybe from kind of five months onwards, five, six months onwards, you may be able to bottle feed your baby from the position they're sat in. Baby can reach for the bottle and feed quite safely like that. If your baby is younger, then we're gonna to have to reposition baby to make sure they're safe when they're feeding. So, one hand on baby and unclip your straps. And then we're gonna sit baby in sideways. So whichever side um, is more comfortable for you to feed, whether you're right-handed, left-handed, uh, doesn't matter. But turn baby seated sideways so their bottom is still over that fabric of the carrier and their, little, their feet will cross slightly and make sure their arms are sort of in front of them there. So once baby's in position we'll bring up the fabric of the carrier and take one strap over your shoulder. I'm going to support baby on my forearm and support baby's head if needed pull that strap down towards my bottom and round and clip it in, clip on the side. The other strap can go under my arm. If this, if you feel like this now with this strap undone is enough support for you, then feed like that, that's absolutely fine. But if you want to pop this other strap on, you can pop it under your arm, it'll come around your back and clip in on the side. So baby's head is free from fabric on the back of their head, their arms are in front of them, their bum is in the pouch of fabric and the fabric supports them from knee pits at least over their bottom and then you can find your bottle and feed your baby making sure their arms are either side of the bottle and that their head and their neck, their shoulders, their hips, their bodies in a nice straight line so they're not turning anything to feed. You can feed them, you're supporting their head in the crook of your arm, their airways are clear and visible. If you have left that other strap undone, be aware that it might be long and trailing around in front of you, you don't want to trip over it. So. Going through the uh, safety checks again, the airways are clear and visible at all times. Be aware of any trip hazards you may have created by undoing straps. You're supporting baby's head, baby's arms are cupping the bottle and the fabric sits from the knee pits at least over bottom and sort of not, not past the back of their head and baby's bottom is in that pouch of fabric. And then when baby's finished, you can pop them back in the carrier in the carry position, so I'm just going to unclip those clips, supporting baby, turning them back round to face me, encouraging the pelvic tilt and popping them back in the carrier. If you have any other questions then pop a message below and I will try to answer as best I can. If you want to see any of my other feeding in slings videos then check out the rest of the Feeding In Slings playlist. Thank you.